Hello, and welcome to this important update for TVET lecturers. I'm Amanda Skinner from Macmillan, and I'm here to explain the recent updates in the Mathematics N4 curriculum, and to show you how our excellent, approved TVET First Maths textbooks help you to implement the revised curriculum. The updated Mathematics N4 curriculum is being implemented in 2022. It is essential that colleges use the latest textbooks to teach the correct curriculum and prepare students for the exam. Look out for the revised curriculum 2022 logo on the front covers. Later in the video, I will tell you more about the three TVET First Mathematics N4 textbooks approved by the DHET for the latest curriculum. These are TVET First Mathematics N4, TVET First Maths by Van Rensburg N4, and TVET First Maths N4 Students' Handbook. Let's start with unpacking the curriculum changes you need to know about. All of the learning outcomes have been renumbered and some of them have been reworded or broken down into more detail. The syllabus emphasizes that Mathematics N4 strives to assist students to obtain trade-specific calculation knowledge. There are six modules instead of seven. The weightings have increased for the modules on complex numbers, differential calculus, and integral calculus. The old module one, which covered equations, manipulation, and word problems, has been removed from the syllabus. In the new module one, which covers determinants, Students are now only required to use the cofactor expansion method to evaluate third order determinants. The diagonal expansion method is not required by the syllabus. In module four on functions and graphs, the syllabus no longer mentions the factor theorem and long division in relation to calculating the roots of the functions being sketched. In module five on differential calculus, the new syllabus specifies that students must be able to sketch graphs, indicating critical points derived from the second derivatives of trigonometric functions, algebraic terms, and polynomials. In the new module six, which is on integration, there is a new section on finding the areas bounded between two curves. This is a change from the old curriculum where students needed to calculate the area bounded by a single curve and the x-axis only. That concludes the main changes to the Maths N4 curriculum. I'm now going to talk about how you choose the best maths textbook for you and your students. As a maths lecturer, you are an expert in your field. You need a textbook that matches your teaching style and one which you are confident will help your particular students master the curriculum and tackle their exam successfully. As you choose your textbook, consider what you prefer to emphasize when you teach. Perhaps it is important to you to focus on the engineering applications of the mathematics that you teach, or to follow a traditional tried and tested approach, or perhaps you want a simple approach that gives students the tools to solve maths problems independently. Think about your students when choosing your textbook. You may have large classes with mixed abilities and background knowledge, or students who are mostly distance learners, or learners who are struggling with their exam techniques. Well, whatever your needs, TVET First has the perfect mathematics N4 course for you. I'm going to start with our TVET First Mathematics N4 by Sunil Chittagun. This full color student's book is a complete course between two covers. It has everything that your students need to succeed in their exams. It has extensive explanations of all the required content and step-by-step -step strategies for solving problems. The examples and activities are designed to help students progress from basic to more advanced skills. The course revises foundational knowledge and refreshes terms and concepts from previous levels of study to make sure that no student is left behind. 
The student's book is full of real-world engineering applications, so students learn how to apply mathematics in an engineering context. It provides a range of study aids, from mnemonics, to help students memorize, to graded worked examples. We have included important tips and reminders throughout the book and a practice exam to prepare students. The student's book has short answers at the end of the book. It is accompanied by a lecturer's guide, which includes full solutions and teaching plans, the memorandum of the practice exam, class tests and memos, as well as useful web links. Who would this book be ideal for? It would be ideal for all students enrolled for Mathematics in 4, but it is also essential for lecturers who teach large, mixed ability classes because the graded activities mean that advanced students will be able to continue independently when necessary. It is perfect for students who need a scaffolded approach and will benefit from lots of support to build up their skills. It caters for students who want varied practice to prepare for the exams. And it's ideal for distance learning students, as the book has so many activities and so much support for successful self-study. The next TVET First Maths course I'm going to tell you about is Maths by Van Rensburg. Van Rensburg is a well-known and popular name among maths lecturers, many of whom have used his textbooks in TVET classrooms for years with great success. He has now updated this tried and tested series to meet all the latest curriculum requirements. Maths by Van Rensburg is an effective and proven learning tool which offers to-the-point explanations, thorough examples and varied activities. It covers the full range of exam requirements. The student's book also includes a practice exam. The short answers at the end of the student's book allow students to check their work. A bonus feature of this textbook is that it includes many enrichment activities which encourage students to get a deeper understanding of the mathematics. Maths by Van Rensburg comes with a lecturer's guide which has lesson plans, complete answers and a memorandum for the practice exam. This series is a great choice for lecturers who feel most comfortable with a textbook that they know well and have come to trust, students who want to consolidate the basics of maths with concise explanations, stronger students who would like to develop their abilities with extension and enrichment activities, and students who wish to learn to apply their knowledge and not simply memorize it. I've covered Mathematics N4 and Maths by Van Rensburg N4. Now let's look at our third brilliant textbook which is the TVET First Math Student's Handbook by Ivan Mappeling. The Student's Handbook is a textbook that gets straight to the point with an uncluttered, practical approach. The Math Student's Handbook has a simple but effective three-step approach. Step 1. Analyze the question. Step 2. Select the correct method and tools needed to solve the question. And Step 3. Apply the method. Students are guided to work through all curriculum requirements applying these three simple steps. The student's handbook also includes full solutions at the back of the student's book, not just short answers, so that students can check exactly where they have mastered the maths and where they need further support or extra practice. Because the answers are provided, no lecturer's guide is necessary. Let's look at who the student's handbook is ideal for. It's perfect for students who are studying mostly on their own and who need everything in one comprehensive hands-on guide. For students who are using another core textbook, the handbook provides extra practical application and help with technique. For students who want a significant leap in their results, whether they are aiming to go from a fail to a pass or a very good to an excellent, this book gets them to make that leap. And finally, the handbook is first choice for lecturers who want to help students take responsibility for their learning. I've taken you through the changes to the Maths N4 curriculum and shown you three courses available from TVET First. Look no further. 
Whatever your math teaching needs, TVET First has just the right textbook.